Cassie, uh, after her freshman season, uh, developed a tumor in her brain behind her eyes, uh, which could not be operated on. Um, and therefore, you know, with a lot of treatment, it was at doctor's discretion that she'd be done playing. Uh, and so she was a two-sport athlete, probably a three-year varsity kid, and uh, wasn't able to uh, play. But then uh, this past fall, we started talking about the idea of maybe having her play for senior night. And so with the help of her family and her doctors, we were able to get her cleared to play for the first minute of the game. And I thought it was just a really neat environment tonight to watch her have that one last chance to go out there and make a, make a bucket, I think was really special for the gym. We had talked about this, yeah, since uh, about October, and then, uh, but there was a lot of things that had to go right before this to happen. We had to have our doctors, and she had a lot of doctors to sign off on it. Uh, we had to make sure we could get her eligible to play, um, and then, you know, make sure we get a lot of things happening, and, and it finally uh, worked itself out. About two weeks ago, I finally told her the news, and very emotional, very happy, and uh, it was a real special moment. I was just so shocked, and I was so happy. I've been counting down the days ever since they told me. And I woke up this morning, I was like, oh my gosh, it's four o'clock and I'm ready to go. <laughs> she's been practicing nonstop. She's been out here uh, shooting those layups over and over. She's been running on the treadmill. She's been doing anything she can to get herself ready for tonight. And uh, just a, a really good kid. And it, it's a kid you really like to root for. She's just a real special uh, a kid that stuck with it when she didn't have to. You know, basketball was over for her three years ago. She didn't have to stay with the team and she did it. And I uh, was uh, just very happy that tonight we could kind of honor her and give her that that one last you know, chance to go out there and play. I came to practice every day and I biked a little to get my stamina and then I just practiced shooting and everything. But basically just clear out, get her the ball. I think nerves set in, we threw a bad pass to her. Uh, we set up an out of bounds play that we were just gonna try to re reset that play and she happened to make a break on the ball and they gave her the ball and got a score. So it was uh, a real, real neat thing. We were just so happy that it worked out the way it did. Oh my gosh, I didn't even know what to do. We had it set up to do a different play and I was like scatterbrained, I had no idea what to do. And then they're like, just do your thing. I was like, all right. So I got open and I was surprised. I made it because it was on the left side. <laughs> I'm glad to be part of this, uh, and really thanks to, to Coach Godbolt and Hebron. They were they jumped on board with this. They wanted anything they could do to help out, so it made it just a real special night. And for the first few minutes of the game, it was nothing about basketball. It was all about Cassie and, and her special night, and I'm just glad that we could be part of it.